If you create website for yourself or maybe for a client, then this one mistake can cost you $5,000 to $100,000. So if you have a website, then make sure you take this one thing very seriously. And that is image copyright infringement. Let me explain. Now I have seen many designers as well as small business website owners making this mistake. They spend a lot of money and time in creating a perfect website. But one thing that they always miss is the images that they use on their site. And what they generally do? They just go to any search engine, they search for the image that they want and they simply go ahead and download it and use it on their website. So if this is how you are getting images for your website, make sure you stop doing it right now. Because sooner or later, you are going to get a big fat notice in your email for the image copyright infringement, which looks something like this. And this email is just one example. If you search online, you will find a lot of similar stories where people got sued for using copyrighted images. In short, if you are building a website and you need some images, you cannot simply download that from any search engine. You can either buy the images from reputed stock photography websites, or there is another way by which you can get free stock images for your website project. So in this video, we are going to take a look at five websites from where we can get free stock images for our website and not just that if you stay with me till the end i will show you how you can use ai to generate free stock images for your website so with the help of ai we will get free stock images which are high in quality and custom made for our specific requirement so if that sounds interesting let's dive in so let's start with the first website and that is unsplash.com if we visit their about us page it mentions about the unsplash license which makes the images on this website free and we are allowed to use them for any personal or commercial project. And I highly recommend that you create an account on this website to get the best out of it. Now some of the features that I like about this site is the categories that they have added on the very top. So let's say you want some textures and patterns for your project. So here we have a separate category for that. And if we scroll down, we can see all the images in this category. And the best part is, let's say you like this pattern here. So you can go ahead and click on this plus sign and add this to your collection. So you can name a collection here. Maybe you can give it a description. You can make the collection as private and then add this image to your collection. Along with that, it got a huge variety of images that you can use for various purposes. Now for all the websites that we are going to cover in this video, you will find all the links in the video description. So you can go ahead and check out these sites and see which one works best for you. Next in our list is Vintage Stock Photos. Now, as the name suggests, this website is the best place to find vintage photos. Now, the website is pretty basic, but the image collection is really cool. You can go ahead and search for any keyword here and you will find some cool vintage images on this site. Now, of course, this website is not for everyone, but if in case you are looking for some vintage images, this website is a good option. All you have to do is just click on any image and you will see download options here. So you can download the full size image or whatever size you wish to have. But once again, you need to create an account on the site in order to download the image. Next in our list is stocksnap.io. And right on their homepage, they have mentioned new creative comma images added daily. So it means we can use these images for any project that we want. So here we can see they have predefined categories or tags here. So if you click on any one of them, you can see all the pictures related to the particular category here. And if you click on any one of these images, we can simply go ahead and download it from here and the image gets downloaded without even registering on the website. So it's a pretty cool website and it got some really high quality image as well that you can use for any kind of project. Next in our list is lifeofpix.com and this one is not as huge as Unsplash or the previous two websites but this is like a portfolio collection of photographers and as you can see right on their homepage they have some featured photographers here. So it says photographer of the week and if you click on this, it's going to open up the portfolio of the photographer and you can see all the images here. And if you like any of these images, you can simply click on download and the image gets downloaded without the need of any registration. Now if you click on the gallery, here they have some predefined categories. So you can look for your desired image in the category listed here, or you can click on the right top corner. Here's a search icon and you can try their search as well. So let's say we just enter the keyword and click on confirm. So here we have all the images for this keyword. And once again, we can simply click on this 
and use the download button here to download this image. Next in our list is Burst. Now this one is a website from Shopify. And once again, right on the home page, they have mentioned the images are available for commercial use. So you can do whatever you want with these images. Now, once again, this website got some really cool images, but it's more focused on products for different categories. Let's say we search for coat. So here we have the result for our keyword. We have some high quality images here and we also have images with the model. So let's say we search for coffee shop. And here we can see some really high quality images. So if you are building a coffee shop site or maybe an e-commerce site, so you can get some really high quality images here. And apart from that, they also have some collections. So if you click on the view all collections from here, you will find some really good organized collections here that you can refer depending upon your project need. And now comes my favorite part that is generating stock images using AI. And for that, we are going to use DALI 3. But the question is, can we use the images generated by DALI 3 for our commercial projects? And the answer is big yes, which you can clearly see on their website, which says that no matter the image generated using the free or the paid version, you have all the rights. So you can use your images whatever way you like. And the best way to access DALI 3 is from the Bing search engine. So all you have to do is just type in the URL bing.com forward slash create and you will land up on this website. And here if we scroll down, we can see some really high quality images generated by DALI 3. So let's try to generate an image and let's see what we get. So let's say I'm building a food blog and I need some food photography images. So let's say I enter this prompt here. So a photo shoot of a noodle plate from the top view for a luxury restaurant so that I can use this for my maybe hero sections or maybe for a particular recipe. So let's see what we get here. So let's click on create. So it's going to take a few seconds and boom, you can see we have a really high quality image that we can use directly on our website. And you can clearly see the image quality is really nice. Apart from that, you can go ahead and mouse over on any of these images. And this is going to show you the exact prompt to generate some similar results. Or you can just edit the prompt to come up with your own idea. So this is how easy it is to use AI to generate some really high quality stock images that you can use for any project, maybe personal or commercial. So this is how you can get copyright free images for your next website project. So if you like this video, then make sure you give it a like and make sure you watch this video right here to learn more about some unique AI websites that will blow your mind. And for more WordPress videos like this, make sure you subscribe to this channel and hit the notification bell so that you will get notified whenever we upload our next video. That's it for this one and I'll see you in the next video.